right, this is Monday Night Football for the Falcons and the Giants. You know, I'm looking outside this stadium, Mercedes-Benz Stadium. This is where the Super Bowl will be on February 3rd coming up. And you know, the way this night looks, well, except for the near full moon back there, this is, is this about the way it's going to look on Super Bowl Sunday night? Yeah. Rise up. Rise up. <laughs> Falcons fans. Here. But they hope the Falcons are going to be here, but the Falcons are not going to be here for the Super Bowl. I don't think so. I'd be shocked. You know, never in the history of the Super Bowl has the hometown team been there. And right now the Falcons aren't good enough to be there. I don't know. They, they, they can surprise us all. But here, here's the thing. We're getting a good feel for what it's going to be like I tell you, this is uh, October, November, December, January. Three and a half months from now. I mean, look at look at the traffic. Yeah, I can see that being like that on Super Bowl Sunday. Well, probably there'll be no traffic because what happens is the NFL and the city kind of takes over the traffic flow, so that's not gonna be moving like that. All right. Then over here, we got, we got what is called Tent City. And you probably remember a video that I took not too long ago from down here. This, this is where people are uh, tailgating in an organized fashion. Look at this. Remember when I was down there and I got that free barbecue? It's pretty good. Now, I got a feeling come Super Bowl Sunday, that's going to be a more of a controlled area probably by the NFL. How's it going? Good. How you doing? I, I'm, I'm doing a Super Bowl video here. Okay. Uh, are you a Falcons fan? I'm a Falcons fan. I'm also a Giants fan. How can you be both a Giants fan and a Falcons fan? By the way, the Falcons are playing the Giants for this Monday night game. How can you be both? Well, I'm originally from New York. Okay. I'm now living in Atlanta. Okay. I'm loving this. Really? Yes. What, you're, he said, what's your name, by the way? My name is Campbell. You should know me. I'm an Antioch choir member. Is that right? Yes. He goes to my church. <laughs> well, well, let me ask you this. And the, and the church is right down the street, by the way. Let me, let me ask you this. I'm doing a Super Bowl video here, and, and I, I'm, I'm just trying to envision what this would be like on Super Bowl Sunday. Uh, what Do you think the vibes will be exactly the same down there or not? I think it'll be a lot worse. They're going to need to knock out some walls and have more security. This is crazy. What's, what, what's crazy about it? The people. We don't do this up north. So this is kind of foreign to me. It's beautiful to see, but uh, they're going to definitely need to knock out some walls. Well, you know... Uh, the Super Bowl was in his city about two Super Bowls ago, maybe three. Uh, giant, you weren't there for the Super Bowl in New York, were you? No, I wasn't. Uh, and, but that, that was crazy because, I mean, the weather, well, how can you have a Super Bowl in New York when it could be like snowstorms and all that kind of stuff? And here, we just worry about an ice storm. Now, right. I'm 53 years old. They call that real football. Outside? Yes. Yes. But not for a Super Bowl? No, I wouldn't recommend it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, it was good seeing you here. I'm going to continue my, my walk around here. Likewise. And uh, we're, going to, we're going to see what else we can, we can find. You never know who you're going to run into here at, the, at these type of things, all right? But I want you to get another view here of the stadium. Look at that. Now, I got a feeling that come Super Bowl Sunday, it'll probably be lit, lit up in different colors. Just because, you know, they want to take, take advantage of the Super Bowl. Just look at the Masters here. And again, think Super Bowl Sunday night. All right. And you got this construction here to the left. I don't know what's going on over there, but I bet you come February the 3rd, that'll be something. Probably going to the parking lot. Or, or either that. or, or could, You know what it's going to be? It could be another tailgating opportunity for folks. You're also going to see a lot of that.
A lot of cop cars for sure. Again, okay, this is this is this is our little preview to what it's going to be like on that Super Bowl night. Okay. Scooters. People can ride ride around in these scooters. How 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 good is how how good is Alabama's football team? How good is Alabama's football team? Yeah. Best in the nation. So here's a question. Are they good enough to beat one of the NFL teams right now? No. They're nowhere near good enough to beat an NFL team. Okay. Well, the bigger question is, are they good enough to beat the University of Notre Dame? No doubt. They will do just like they did in, what was it, 2012? It's time to move on. Thank you. <clears throat> he, he doesn't know what he's talking about. He doesn't know what he's talking about. So now we're getting close. Look at this. Big time security guards. We'll see. We'll see a lot of that on Super Bowl Sunday for sure. And this little area where I'm going to go through to check in for the media. I'm willing to bet you it's not going to be as easy as it is going to be here to go through. See, here, here's a, here's the media line right here. See how short that thing is? Look at that. The opera word is crazy. <laughs> 